Hey, what's up, guys? This is Ankit from SpectraMind.com, and today we will see how to edit WordPress admin URL. So, before we actually dive into the actual process, let's try to understand why we actually need to do it. As you may know, WordPress is the most preferred platform to build a blog or a professional website, and being so famous, it makes it favorite among hackers as well. And the most common type of hacking WordPress websites get is the brute force stack, in which a hacker simply uses applications and scripts to guess your WordPress admin password by trying multiple login attempts using various possible combinations of WordPress username and password. So what makes it so easy for hackers to do that? The reason is. If a website is built using WordPress, then the admin URL will always be like www.yoursite.com forward slash WP admin. And that makes it so easy for hackers to start trying the brute force attack. But if you could change this WordPress admin URL, hackers will now first have to find our new admin URL and then do the brute force attack. And that's a lot of work for them. Hackers never spend so much time on one website because there are millions of other websites that are more vulnerable to hacking. So how exactly we can change the WordPress admin login URL? Thankfully, there are plugins available to do the job in a simple way. The best plugin available to change the WordPress login URL is WPS Hide Login. This is a simple plugin whose only job is to change WordPress admin login URL. Pretty straightforward. All you have to do is go to Plugins, click on Add New, and then search for WPS Hide Login. Once you install it, just click on Activate and then scroll down to the bottom of the page and there you will find an option to add new admin URL for your WordPress website. And that's it. You now have a new unique admin URL for your website. And if you try to log in using wp-admin, it will never work now because we have shifted our admin URL to a new custom made URL. Please make sure you take a backup of your website and database before trying this plugin. And just to make it more secure, you can always change this custom URL any number of times so that you can have a custom URL up whenever you want. If you learned something new with this video, make sure you hit that like button and share this video. And for more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to this channel right now.